Are we still recording? Yeah. <laughs> We're all like, I can't tell. <laughs> that has to go on the video, like us going, are we still on? Watch it twice so it can be nice. Oh, and you can get a good, good ride. If you guys don't know how to cook, this is gonna be the tutorial for you. I think this should become a monthly thing, P.S. Yes. Oh, I, 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 so I that I so. can get my resume up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, what are I, what's I supposed to say again? Oh, saying, um, this is chat sets. Welcome to my YouTube channel. We are with Coco's Chick Chicken. Chicken. <laughs> <laughs> channel we're with coco's kitchen jet set squad's official chef. chef and we're about to make some barbecue chicken some rice and peas and steamed veggies stay tuned what up what up it's your girl coco <laughs> i'm malika lou and i'm from coco's kitchen and we're from jet set squad yes <laughs> so today we're going to be doing a tutorial we're going to be teaching miss malika how to cook. All right. So first things first. Got to wash your hands, dry your hands and then put on some gloves. What are we going to be making? So barbecue chicken, some rice and peas and some steamed veggies. And I also made us some passion fruit martinis so we can get tipsy mm -hmm. while we learn how to cook. Of course. Okay. Of course. <laughs> Don't judge me if they're strong. Cheers. 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 Thank you. Cheers. Okay. That's that's good. Good. Yeah. Oh, it's gonna be much stronger than this. First things first. We're gonna clean our chicken because that's what we do. Alright? So I'm just gonna instruct you and you're gonna do most okay. of the work today. Don't you have to cut the fat off the chicken too? Mm -hmm. So I cut the pieces. Some people keep the skin on, some people take it off. It's up to you. I like keeping my skin on. It gives it, you know, the extra flavor, the little extra fat in it, but that's where the flavor is. Mm -hmm. So I already cut my lemons. We have some vinegar, and then we have our chicken here. So I'm just gonna to the chicken. How much? Um, you know, just put like quarter, like maybe like half full, and then gonna add some lemons and then half the full of the bowl. Mm -hmm. Oh. Say word. Yeah. Oh, more? Um, just a little more. Are we gonna need any of this later? Yeah, yeah, just for the the cabbage for the steamed bed. Oh, yeah, that's good. That's good. All right. We're we gonna. So we're gonna get some lemons and then we're just gonna squeeze them on top. I'll use all of them. So okay. Squeeze the lemons. Add some juice. I forgot to bring my notebook. Oh. Okay, we can just look back on the video. <laughs> if you guys don't know how to cook, this is gonna be the tutorial for you. Okay, it's just gonna be a, a simple, well, I think it's simple, but it's simple. We're gonna break it down, show you how to cook. Mm -hmm. Keep on squeezing. Do I put it in? Um, yeah, you can just oh. like leave it in. Yeah, yeah, with all of them. Water on top and then we can just. Rub it, massage it in, mix it around, and clean it. Can we use some lemon and kind of, yeah, yeah, give it right, a yeah, uh -huh. okay. okay. She knows a little something. I am half Jamaican. Okay. To take away all of the toxins and germs, and that's just something that we do as Jamaicans. And that's why we go She's like, as you are. the short. What kind of YouTube video? How long do we do this for? Um, everybody's look a little different. Um, I just, you know, once you kind of get all pieces, just kind of get in there. And then you can kind of use, um, here. Use 
for scissors and then now you cut off Oh hell no the facts and because <laughs> I thought you were gonna make me <laughs> cut bones or something. Oh, no. I was like, oh hell no, you lost me there. I'm not about to be cracking nothing up in here. Uh -uh. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah, so you could just yeah, kinda of take it out. Mm -hmm. And then like just yeah, just trim so what? here. So I'll show you like how yeah, I yeah, do yeah, the yeah. first one. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Alright. So there's this little kind of trim hair I just cut there. And then that will be easier to cut off the sides of the, like the fat, just the extra fat. So we keep in the skin on, okay? And then I cut off this little, I don't know what it is, but we're just gonna cut that off, okay? And then just any other like little flyaway pieces that you see that need to get, or extra fat pieces that just need to get cut off. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I think that one's pretty good, and then you can just do that with the rest. I am disgusted. This is disgusting. Um, that's the part of cooking chicken that people hate is the cleaning part. How are you gonna cook chicken and not cook it? It's, it is nasty sometimes, I won't lie. I remember I, my first time when I made a turkey. This one's thick. Oh. I, um, I was cleaning the turkey, took it, and when I saw like all the insides of the turkey. <laughs> That's true. I got real disgusted. coming out? Like, yeah, like, like the, the bag in and the whole turkey. Nah. And then I remember there was like a lump on the turkey um, itself, and I became vegetarian after that. But it didn't last. No, it didn't oh. last long. <laughs> <laughs> didn't last long. As you see, she loved it. I was, yeah. I was vegetarian for about like four months, but uh, you know. How's this looking? Mm-hmm. Good. Yeah. Next. Yeah. Next one. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's the corners for me. Yeah. Thick. <laughs> can you can you hold it like you love the chicken a little bit? You have to show it love, and then when you show the Leroy. food love. Massage yeah, when you talk, you know, when you talk to the chicken and you feel the chicken and you give the chicken love, then you see how far I am from like the say I'm like here. I couldn't believe that someone would actually, you know, prepare a chicken like that. He's already dead. Yeah. Oh, it's just. Yeah. Ugh. We can name our chicken. What do you want to name him? Leroy. That's what you said. Yeah, Leroy? might as well, Leroy. Leroy? Anyway. Sorry, Leroy. People that may ask, you can make this barbecue chicken with any part of the chicken. Any broth. part of the chicken, yeah. You know, I just, you know, used to use, used to making the chicken legs with the back attached, or I just say chicken leg. Back attached. Um, back attached. Back attached. So this is. There's a yellow thing in here. So yeah, you can just snip that out. What is that? Yeah. Ew. Oh, that was just a lemon seed. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Here, so you can just 
go Why? Because of the hairs? Mm -hmm. So the, when the chicken gets processed, mm -hmm. like from wherever you buy it from, sometimes they leave the feathers on it. And so... So Asia, you know it's actually chicken. So it's real chicken. Yeah. <laughs> so Asia right now is making sure... So she's deep feathering the chicken. <laughs> Yes. This is a whole job. Yes. And men want you to come and do a job on top of this? Nah. Yes. No way. You're goddamn right. <laughs> you probably you shouldn't find much hair. Yeah. You should it And I mean, even if you have like a little one, two hairs, you'll live. It builds character. I don't see any hairs on this one. Is it every single one you gotta inspect? Like, oh look, there's a hair. <laughs> Maybe some kitchen tweezers, you know, just... Oh, sorry, is that... No, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you can tell she really don't cook. <laughs> she said it's not a real thing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so for anybody <laughs> kind of thought we were playing, yeah. that is proof she don't know what she's doing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't cook. I'm here to... I'm trying yeah, to learn. Yeah, I'm yeah. trying... Life comes at you fast. I'm trying to elevate. <laughs> you know? And I'm trying to be a white. Just, and we <laughs> are here for it. Okay, who's like, doing this with this big knife? <laughs> oh, this is great. I don't want to go for <laughs> Who else wants to learn how to cut? Come. You can DM me at Coco's Kitchen for all three. Just a little more ump in it. You want a hair like this? It's great. Yeah. He's a grater. No. That's what you're doing. Basically. I bet you it work. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Slightly, right? Maybe. Look. No. Yeah, this part's not for me. <laughs> On the inside, is I like to make three lines. Just like so. Oh. Yeah, so the so three lines so it can seep inside. So if you want to do that, so just one, two, three. That's a good little hack. Mm -hmm. And you can do that with any any kind of chicken. With chicken breast, you can do that. If it's chicken um, like drumsticks, then just like one line because there's not much to do. But yeah, just make a little line in the chicken so all the seasoning can get nice and absorbed that's the word oh. into it like this was already I'm like saying, we didn't even start and i felt like this is a long day <laughs> you know my back is like my back's hurting <laughs> so uh, now we're gonna do our green seasoning okay so that's new gloves so side note so what i was saying to get time I meant fresh time, but it's okay, we still gonna make it work. So not the no, time in the bottle? No, not, not the time in the bottle. What's like the fresh. difference? Mm. Jamaicans. <laughs> that, yeah. is, that is honestly the difference. The difference is Jamaican. That is the difference. All right. So, you know, we just like everything she fresh. Just like, you know, use she... garlic powder when you need garlic, you know? Okay, yeah, that, that is like, okay, I guess. that, that is... time, we need a real fresh time, mm -hmm. you know? Because I even put like the stem sometimes. So well, you want me to go to the garden and no. go get time? <laughs> You're gonna cut off the, the bottom, end, the bottom. Yeah. I mean, that was a little far <laughs> to cut off, but it's okay. You wanna eat this? No, <laughs> like you. <can't. laughs> oh, oh, oh. Like, look, it's white, so you gotta cut it off. But you could have cut off just like oh, right here. You oh, didn't have to cut off. Same word. You cut off. Yeah, big chef. Listen, Ooh. I'm gonna have a ring. I, I'm, I'm gonna have a ring. 
Because if I'm about to be making all these meals and slaving in the kitchen, listen. No. I'm gonna be a wife. I'm gonna be a wife. Well, it's for real. Like <laughs> my, so my best friend, we live together. Um, not anymore, but we used to live together late. And when she, we first moved in, my girl was burning bacon, was burning everything. Burning water? Burning She couldn't meet. <laughs> she couldn't make anything, okay? And let me tell you. You have to tell them the story how she had to cook for you when you were sick. That is oh, yeah. you gotta get tell them. But before that is I already was starting to teach her how to cook certain dishes. So when I was sick, she made me some porridge. I had to kind of walk her through it while I was porridge? sick in bed. Yeah, while mm -hmm. I was sick in bed. That was her first time making it. Well, let me tell you, my girl now can make rice and peas, macaroni pie, chicken, steamed veggie, dip. She can make anything. And she basically was my sous chef for she got a man? Past. She has a man now. Hallelujah. That's a, that, oh, that, that is, is, yeah. that is the benefit. Oh, that is the benefit of Coco's Kitchen School. Okay. <laughs> Coco's Kitchen School. Amen. Enroll today. to something because it's it, not fresh it, it, well, yeah. <laughs> okay so how do we do this do i cut the tips and then yeah, i like so you cut the it? tips and so how i just put all that so a little trick how i do it is i just oh yeah 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 crush it down and then go like that and then it kind of just peels right off oh It didn't work. Is this okay. even? Oh no, that, it, the skin's already Because. Yeah. <laughs> oh, ow. I put in my whole. Oh, she's not on your lips. She's putting her body weight into it. She's putting her back into it. That's what. Listen. My girl is putting her arm into that garlic. <laughs> yeah, but if I don't put my weight into it, it won't cry. Uh, <laughs> like, do you want the job done or not? Okay. <laughs> Shit. Right, so gonna now add those one, two, three, four, five, the six cloves. You're not gonna chop it up a bit? Mm -mm. This is I'm not just, gonna ruin my. No, it's not. Alright. It's not gonna ruin my blender. This is a ninja, okay? This ain't gonna have some beat. You know? <laughs> Alright. Right. When it starts to hurt, like, I'm gonna be looking at you. Can we look at <laughs> Can I add wait, wait, wait. Let me mentally put my notes in my head. Oh. We put green onions. Uh -huh. Regular onions mm -hmm. and garlics. Mm -hmm. Garlics. <laughs> and now we're gonna add four pimentos. 
seeds. Okay. Is this like a peppery type of thing? Uh, all spice. All spice. That's all spice. the Canadian equivalent. Yeah. All spice. All spice. <coughs> all spice seeds. A pimento. Four seeds. Four. We'll pretend it's fresh. Okay. So just like a touch. Oh, that's a lot. Mm. How is this going to like make it taste? That gives it like that weird... Not really weird, but like with all of it, like like I find green seasoning is that flavor booster. Like it boosts like all of the other, like all the other seasonings that you're gonna add to it. The green seasoning is kind of like the activator for it. Okay. Water. You're just gonna add some water about half halfway, yeah, or just like a little below half, and then we'll kind of go as yeah. See the consistency. Uh, let's add a little more. Yeah. So, it is to the right. Because <laughs> if this is, I've had she, my ninja for how long? She said she ain't played. This ain't no Hamilton Beach, Asia. Now that that is done, so we're not only going to use that for the chicken, we're going to use it for the rice, also for the steamed veggies as well. Oh. Yeah. It's all purpose. So now we get to seasoning. Ready? Mm -hmm. Take a sip so we can challenge our ancestors. Cheers. Yes! It's <laughs> <laughs> not the ancestor just about to get here. And it's a Sunday. Great and <laughs> Hallelujah! <laughs> Alright. So, they did not do that at Willowdale. Yeah. Which church is that? <laughs> My church. <laughs> <laughs> Some of the seasoning is Italian, brown white pepper, garlic powder, and so, turmeric. Question, mm -hmm. just to put it out there, you know how they have like the name brand stuff and the mm -hmm. no name brand stuff? It's the same stuff. It's the same thing. Whichever they, probably, on, they got all from the same manufacturer, which is different. Whichever one is on sale, you get it. The Caribbean spice and roasted garlic and all-purpose season from Cool Running. So you can use any West Indian brand once it's an all-purpose and like a garlic kind of roasted spice. From time to time I'll also add cumin, just a little bit. So cumin and, and turmeric, I just add a little, you know, to my foods. Turmeric has a lot of um, good health benefits. What? I'm not sure, but I know it's healthy. Turmeric? Yeah. Yeah, it's good for your skin, I think. Yeah. And it's an anti-inflammatory. Definitely. Anti-inflammatory. Mm. Anti well, you just add like a little bit just to kind of give a little, you know, a little, uh, mm -hmm. like a tap. Uh, yeah. Mm. Okay, that's it. So now, Italian seasoning. How much? Until your ancestors say, stop, stop. Girl, <laughs> tell me how much because you better look. Because this whole bag is supposed to go in here. <laughs> okay, if that's a, you know. I don't know. Okay, yeah, let's add a little more. Yeah. Yeah, that's. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Garlic powder. Yeah. I know this one you go ham. Oh, see, then you still watch the Yes, yes. Because yes. yes. the garlic powder, yeah. Italian style. <laughs> white pepper. You'll be like, white pepper, black pepper, what? Yeah. I'm the same, but I, I like white pepper better. I find it I never have a little, white. like. It's less greeny. Yeah. That's, maybe that's why, yeah. Less there's more powdery. Like, black yeah, pepper, it has too much grain. It's yeah. like more granule. Yeah. So, this I gotta be careful with, right? Now you, you have to be careful, yeah, because you don't want it to be too spicy. You can add a little more. I, I mean, for me, I like a little kick to my stuff. It's not like spicy, but it just gives you a little like a, oh, okay, the spice is here. Like it's seasoned. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Caribbean spice and roasted garlic. Just keep going. Mm -hmm. So that one we just can give a little more. Mm -hmm. Give a little more. That's good. And then all-purpose seasoning. 
This is like the garlic. You just. That's, really, that's good. Oh. But then we don't want to put too much because this is like where the salt is. Uh, so like for me, when I cook, I don't add salt to like any of my foods good. itself. I just use the, the seasoning. Low cholesterol. Yeah. Is that for the salt? Or is it sodium? sodium. sodium. My bad. Sodium. Sorry. <laughs> I know. I'm like, can I go to the last day? Low sodium. Oh, you can start mixing that. I mix the dry rub before we add in the green seasoning. Just, just kind of just yeah, mix it, it nice all around. Talk to Roy. Yeah. How was your day? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You feeling nice? Mm -hmm. I'm feeling nice. He's feeling real nice. Leroy looking nice and colorful. Oh look at Leroy go, Leroy. Leroy. So that now we're gonna add our green seasoning. Fresh, fresh green seasoning. Okay. So hopefully we'll pour it. Are y'all gonna like preheat the oven? <laughs> the drinks are kicking in. <laughs> <laughs> um, we can cook a little faster. We're gonna preheat to 400. 400. There you go. We are going to, while it breathes, we can kind of just wrap it up. Just put a little foot on, we just put it in the freezer for a little bit. I mean, marinate. Mar like, uh, let it just marinate for a bit. If you had more time, you know, I would marinate. Marinate. Marinate overnight. overnight. Or even a couple hours. But same way, it tastes good. Once you put the right seasonings and so forth, you know, like but it just gives it a little extra flavor to the bone. Like the bone, you can taste the seasoning mm -hmm. in the bone overnight. Okay. So when I do this for my man, I gotta do it overnight. You gotta do it overnight. Night. Yep. You yeah. gotta prep. You know. You gotta what? prep. Yep. So you can change those gloves because you were all up on Leroy. Okay. We're gonna use um, just a rice cooker for this tutorial. Um, you know, if it's just one person or two persons. You don't need a big pot of rice. So, rice cooker, okay? We're going to do one cup of rice. This is also a smaller rice cooker too. We don't want it to overflow. Some liquor cooking the porridge. <laughs> it around kind of massage the rice a little bit too as you do it clear out the water and then do it one more time okay wash the rice twice so it can be nice <laughs> so like this yeah yeah like one thing i do now yeah since i'm asian yeah you can make some rice yeah <laughs> 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 the rice that we are using today is jasmine rice. I prefer parboiled, um, but yeah, we're just going to use jasmine for today. Okay, so we're going to rinse off the can. Uh, wash it off. I was doing this before COVID. So we just drain, I drain all the, the juice from the beans. Just drain it off, just like so. And then do you put it in here? Mm -hmm. And then that's it. Well, then we add the seasoning, water. yeah, oh, the water, the seasoning. seasoning and all that. Oh. Um, if I cook it, so that's just like the lazy way of kind of doing rice and peas. Um, now, if I cook it in a pot, what I'll do is I'll kind of like season and stew down the, the peas a bit before I add the, so I'll do that and then I'll add the, the washed rice and then the water and all of that. Mm -hmm. Or, you know, people soak their peas and all of that. Or time, you know, cans is just simple. Let's work. Mm -hmm. 
thing. We want rice and peas, not peas and rice. So, attitude. <laughs> cups of rice. So we're gonna add. Let's get our coconut milk. Which can or bottle? We're gonna do the can. Mm -hmm. Let's wash off the can as well. And you add water and the coconut milk. Mm -hmm. But the coconut milk will count as like part of the water. Okay. So we don't want it to come out too soggy. So, um, so we're gonna add a cup of coconut milk. give it some color to the rice and peas. Should I put it in the top? Um, no, you could just, just <laughs> you could just pour it in. I'm scared. Just easy. A touch? Kind of other, yeah, just. Well, you can add a little more than a touch. Like a touch, touch. That's like, like, like a yeah. tan. Like, yeah. Not a carrot tan. When you said get browning, I was like Googling, what is browning? <laughs> <laughs> The juices from the chicken already. Oh. So I was like, oh, we're just gonna make our own browning. Oh, no, but no. you need browning. Brown. To make brown. pride or grace bran. Yeah, that's that calls for a oh, great. You're gonna add a teaspoon of chicken bouillon, like broth mix of like chicken, chicken stock. Chicken stock. Chick powder. 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 Chicken powder. Chicken powder. Chickens, yeah. Teaspoon. So yeah, just or just like a half, just because it's we're doing a mini version. Like this? We could do that and then we'll just add other seasons to that, yeah. And then we're gonna add the same seasonings. We're gonna add some all-purpose, some Caribbean spice garlic. How much are we putting of each? Um, Ancestors? Just just a little bit because it is a smaller pot. So just like a, a little touch. Of, a, a touch of everything. See, me, I like to put it in here you first. You can do that too, yeah. Yeah, because next thing you know, I ruined the whole meal. Yeah. There we go. Uh, let's do a teeny bit more. That's good, yeah. See? Same type of vibe. Mm-hmm. Yeah. some garlic powder. <laughs> Get out! Yes, you yeah. Taste the flavor there. So then you'll see okay, if I need to add a little more. See my face. You know? I was like, seasoning into this. Is that me? Yeah. With the same spoon? You can just use <laughs> You don't have to do all that. You can even just like. Touch it with my finger? Yeah. yeah. And then like you just like, yeah, change your glue. Do you taste like a little like a little pizzazz? Yeah. Do you think it needs a little? <laughs> do you think it needs like a little bit more seasoning? I don't know. Oh, I don't know what I'm supposed to be. Yeah, you taste it. 
It's real coconut it's, here, right? Mm, but it it has a flavor. It could it depends. Some people like their you know some people like their rice like a little not like too over seasoned because then it's like they would put the gravy and the chicken like it all comes together. But um, I'll say you could add maybe just a little. I'll say a teeny bit more. Of the all purpose. All right. And just stir it around again? Yeah. So now we're just gonna put it and let it cook. Take my gloves off. Mm -hmm. One hour later. So now we're just gonna take a bowl. We're going to add some Diana sauce. This is just a simple barbecue chicken. So we're just gonna put some Diana in just here. The whole bottle, half. Just, yeah, about half a bottle. We're gonna add a little bit of browning to it. Okay. And then I just add some of the juices from the chicken into the bowl. Okay, so we'll just, like that. And just pour it like so. Sugar to it, brown sugar to it. Okay. For steamed veg, um, we're gonna cut up the carrots and the cabbage. It all depends. Everybody does their steamed veg different, or how they cut it up. Um, sometimes they just cut it in like chunks, or people kind of like it nice. like more like nice thinly like sliced, kind of like a coleslaw, but like not like as thin, but everybody's veggies are different. You can cut it in half first. Somewhat a half. Okay. Just move that, and then you can okay. kind of just Sugar and then we're gonna season it for taste. Okay, 
really easy. Green seasoning, vinegar, sugar, seasonings, along with the veggies. I cannot wait to eat it. I can't wait to plate it. That yeah. part is my favorite. Remember I told you the, the rice in the, the cup? cup. Yeah. yeah. I want it to look perfect. Yeah. So when I bring it to my boo at the end of the day, I want to be wife material. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so just a little bit of fruit oh, yeah. in the pot. Yeah, just like a tablespoon, tablespoon and a half in the pot. Wait for it to sizzle up a bit. Meanwhile. <laughs> well, now we can add our veggies, our cabbage to it. We have the veggies on the stove. Now we're gonna add some seasoning and some vinegar to it. Am I in the way? Uh, no. <laughs> so, so shuffle. All right. So we're gonna add some garlic powder. How much? Ancestors? Ancestors. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes for like color or whatnot, or even flavor, some people put soy sauce or whatnot. Everybody makes their steamed veg different. Like I said, this is just a little simple, one-on-one, -on -one, easy version. Okay? We're just gonna mix. You're gonna add a little bit of vinegar. Not much, just maybe like a tablespoon. Or maybe, let's do like a half. A half a cup. and then we're gonna add some white sugar. We're gonna have it here. Oh. You can yes. even add, yep, you could even just add like a little bit of water to it. Not much, just, what is this? Not even a, a quarter. We'll just add a little water. Keep mixing. Yep, keep mixing. Put a in there. A little longer than a few minutes later. Because what's next? Is the rice done? Mm -hmm. The rice is done. Chicken done. Retain done. This down? Yes. Yeah. I'm gonna put it back in. Kind of like kind of flip and stir and uh -huh. kind of taste one. You can even taste that one that kind of was a runaway. <laughs> See like if the flavor is there, if it needs a little more sugar or a little more seasoning. Yeah. Whatever you think. Yeah. Here? Yeah, I could, yeah, I could put it there. Is that where you would put it? Yeah. Or like even like space it out a bit more or put or you can like maybe for yours because yours is a little bit more like centered, everything centered. So here? Yeah.
<laughs> Ring where? <laughs> no, the seasoning? This is it. Yeah, here, I'll clap here. I need to just pick up the chicken in. <laughs> The chicken is giving like a zesty, like lemon spice. You just have like all the, all the flavors of birds. Is ginger in your mouth. Why is it tasting ginger? Mm -hmm. Everything's tasting nice. Kick of spice. The kind of jabbit. It. So yeah. pop this up. We're putting this in my fridge because I need food for the week. Yeah. You look crazy. 